The mentor is very important to me also after the fellowship. I can email my mentors questions, x-rays, and they answer me during the same day. It's very useful for me, so I've been able to do more cases and difficult cases with their help, even though we are not in the same continent. The advantage for a fellow to have an AO mentor is that he has a person in front who has more experience than himself, who has a certain reputation, who can give advice, who can show him how he does it. And this is one of the things that many scholars like to know how a specific person with a certain reputation does an operation, how he handles the patient, how he handles the operation itself, but also the aftercare and everything. Many of our AOVET fellows continue to have an ongoing relationship with us. For instance, when they have challenging cases that are in our area of expertise, they'll email images with questions, and we can discuss the case later by email or on the phone. The idea of mentorship is a very important one, and the ability to impact on the professional development of a young surgeon gives us really tremendous pleasure in terms of knowing that we've been able to do that. The mentorship for many fellows is probably the most important thing because it gives you somebody who's seen you, who's been around a long time, probably seen everything, that you can call friend, you can actually ask for help if you need to. For me it was uh, great because it was an involvement into the AO at the beginning and then I've persisted and now as a trustee I'm part of the uh, organisation. I have now trained about 20 fellows in Pakistan and they are all over the country. They share their problems with us. We are constantly in touch with them on the net, on the phone. They constantly get advice on difficult cases, how to manage them. I think when young people visit centres of excellence that host AO fellowships, they often establish a relationship, a professional mentor-protégé relationship with one of their teachers. I think the fellowships are a very fertile ground for these relationships to grow. I think the mentor-protégé relationship, if it arises naturally rather than being imposed, can be a very successful influence in the evolution of the career of the protégé and indeed enrich the professional life of the mentor.